Good morning to all my wonderful viewers out there. I hope you're having a wonderful weekend. It is Sunday the 19th of April, which means we have to talk about an upcoming release that is releasing on Monday. Yes, I know, Daniel's ahead of the game. He's finally covering stuff that is releasing or like before it releases. <laughs> I know, I know guys, I've been slacking a little bit. I'm sorry I didn't cover the Kith Sailor Moon stuff or the um, Jordan 6, was it DMPs? The the black and gold joints? Yeah, I'm, I'm so sorry I didn't cover those. Look, if you guys want me to cover them in a video now that they've been released, I can definitely do that for you guys. I just thought I'd say I'm sorry that I didn't cover them. I, I've been working every day this week, even on Saturday, and um, I just I just ran out of time to cover it all. So I'm hoping to get back on track and cover some upcoming releases. And in today's video, we're going to do that. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the upcoming release, all the release details, all the pieces releasing in Kith's Earth Day Monday program. Yes, guys, it wouldn't be the start to a week if we didn't talk about the first thing that is releasing in the week, which is always the Kith Monday program. Now, for this Monday, 20th of April, we are getting a Earth Day centered Monday program release. Why? Well, because Earth Day is on Wednesday, the 22nd, and obviously they're not going to do a Wednesday program. They're going to do the Monday program release. So it's releasing on Monday. Now, from what it looks like, this Monday program capsule, because it's focused around Earth Day, is focused around sustainability and, you know, using and creating pieces that are low on pollution and use recycled materials by the looks of it. I'm not fully uh, sure about what materials they use and everything like that, but hopefully Ronnie Feig's Instagram post that I have for us today will clear that all up. So what we'll do to cover this upcoming Kith Monday program release is head over to Ronnie Feig's Instagram post, read his capsule, look at all the pieces, cover everything that's releasing and all the release details, and I'll give you my thoughts and opinions on each of the pieces that are releasing as a part of this Monday program. Now, just to forewarn you, these pieces that are being showcased in Ronnie Fogg's Instagram may not be all the pieces that released on the Monday program. We never really get more than three pieces. We sometimes get a couple more, but it's never usually a lot. But hopefully this Instagram post is every piece that is releasing this Monday program. We're just going to have to see. So we'll cover what we have and hopefully that's all that releases. Just thought I'd say that because sometimes these posts, he, you know, uploads more pieces to the um to the monday program capsule and then i'm like ah well i covered as much as i could <laughs> so we'll we'll head over to the instagram post now that ronnie feig has posted cover everything there talk about it there so without further ado let's head on over to ronnie feig's instagram and talk about the earth day if monday program and here we are. So what I'll do is we'll read the article. Oh, well, sorry, article. We'll read the description of the post, go through all the details there, then cover the pieces that are releasing. Now, from first glance, it just looks like a tea and a tote bag, but maybe Ronnie, or well, I'm hoping that Ronnie Feig's description of his post will cover all the details to do with the release. If it uses recycled materials, how it um, relates to Earth Day, everything like that. And then I'll, of course, you know, cover my thoughts and opinions on it, whether or not it's worth it or not. I mean, it's using sustainable materials, so I'm going to, of course, say it's worth it. Because, I mean, I, I like the idea of brands coming out and trying to go for the most sustainable approach possible. But enough of that. Let's dive into the Instagram post and see what it has to say. We celebrate Earth Day this year with this coming Monday program. Trademark. <laughs> so weird so weird I, I mean i understand why it's trademarked but it's 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 very weird to add it in the sentence but i suppose he probably has to each tea will come with a kith earth coat made from sustainable fabric an important element that we are that we are uh, were that were it should be we are but it's were there for some reason Sorry, Ronnie, I've got to put you, I've got to point it out there. <laughs> An important element that we are focusing more and more on in our production process. A portion of the proceeds of this launch will be, uh, will be donated to Pure Earth, a New York based non for profit focusing on solving pollution problems in lower income countries by teaching communities how to improve soil, water and air conditions in cost effective ways. 
let's take a small let's take small steps towards a better world together there you go guys so it looks like that you'll be able to purchase a bunch of white tees with a nice little earth on it with the kith logo on it and a nice little flower growing out of the top of it kind of looks like jack and the beanstalk a little bit there it looks like with each tea that you purchase you'll get a sustainably made tote bag with it now it's interesting it didn't really mention too much if the tea is sustainable i know that if the tea is 100 percent cotton there's a lot of water being used to grow the cotton the the embedded water used in the tea would be huge it would be massive yeah seriously i have yourself google uh embedded water cost in teas and clothing you'll be blown away by how many liters of embedded water we use just to make a simple little white tea so i don't know if the tea is very sustainable but i suppose in the long run buying this tea does uh give some money to a very sust uh, sustainable uh non-for-profit so in, in the long run it's doing some good uh, I'm very happy to hear that Ronnie looks like he's trying every day to make it more sustainable. It probably does lower costs if you take a big initial cost to produce your things more sustainably. And then over the long run, I can assume that it would probably, you know, pay you back. It eventually would lower the costs of buying these, um, you know, this cotton, all these materials. I suppose if you did find the sustainable ways, it would lower the cost eventually. I like that this little Monday program is dedicated to Earth Day. It's very sweet. The tote bag is actually really, really nice. I like the color on it. And it's cool that if you buy the tea, you get the tote bag. I thought this was gonna be, a, you know, you can buy either the tote bag or the tea, but it looks like that you get the tea and you get the tote for free. I, I can't, can't complain about that. Um, yeah, I'm just really happy to see that Kith is trying to go for a more sustainable uh, approach when it comes to their releases. Um, as I said, hope, hopefully this isn't the only time that um, they try and do this, try and do sustainable, you know, clothing. Hopefully in the future, Kith will do sustainable um, seasonal collections without having to mention it, if you kind of get what I mean. So I hope in the future that Kith does um, make all their pieces sustainably produced. You know, it doesn't produce a bunch of pollution. It doesn't use uh, incredibly large amounts of water. It, maybe it even recycles materials. Um, so if he did that in seasonal collections across the board and then wouldn't even have to go on record and say it's sustainable because we just know it's all sustainable, I think that would be a really good move for Kith. I mean, to have the really high quality that Kith offers and to have it sustainable, that just sounds like a win-win to me. So hopefully... This is a good step in the right direction. I'm super keen to see what Kith does with this. But to, to talk more specifically about what's releasing in this capsule, I don't know if we're getting more colors of the tea or if we're just getting a white tea. I'm not complaining though. I actually kind of like the little uh, cute little Earth Day design on it. I like it because it's a white tea. And hey, if it comes with a tote bag with the same design on it, I can't complain about that. That is awesome. That's, I'm, I, it's literally perfect. If I bought a tea and you, I got a free tote bag with it, hell yeah. I would be buying up teas left and right. <laughs> so yeah, good on Kith. I'm, I'm super happy to see this being released. It'll be releasing on their online store. I think it's 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, but don't quote me on that. The best way to find about with upcoming releases is if you go to the Kith website, you can actually go to the store pages early and they have counters uh, counting down to the drop time when it actually releases in your time zone. So you, you yourself can find out when they actually drop in your time zone. It's very, very handy. Um, but yeah, super cool little uh, Earth Day Monday program. Teas, totes, free totes. Um, and looks like Kith is trying to go to a more sustainable future and they're donating some of the proceeds to a non-for-profit. So, I mean, that just sounds like a perfect Monday program release to me. I, I honestly wouldn't mind picking it up, but I spent all my money on some vintage pieces as of late, which I definitely will be unboxing on the channel for you guys. So, I will be missing out on this Monday program release because of that. But I want to know if you guys are going to be picking it up. Are you looking to pick up this Kith um, Earth Day Monday program? Is it for you? Would you pick this up? I mean, if anything, I, I think it's probably one of the better Kith Monday programs to pick up, mainly because it does the whole, you know, donating to the, don donating to the non-for-profit, uh, you get a free tote with it. I mean, it, it honestly just sounds like a win-win to me, but maybe you disagree, maybe you feel differently about it. Either way, let me know all your thoughts and opinions on this upcoming Monday program on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, 
or as always in that comment section below. And that looks to be everything that is releasing in Kith's April 20th Earth Day Monday program. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on it. How do you feel about Kith doing this sustainable, um, you know, tea and tote bag? Oh, well, sorry, it may just be the tote. We're not 100% sure on that. A little bit confused about that one. But how do you feel about that? Do you feel it's just a marketing move and something to do because it's Earth Day? Or do you feel it's quite genuine because Ronnie Feig is going on record saying, He's going to continue looking into doing, you know, more sustainable releases in the future. Uh, how do you feel about that? I think it's genuine. I think he's genuinely trying to make a change by making this clothing. And hopefully in the future, as I said, we can look forward to seasonal releases that are all made from sustainable materials. Hopefully that's the case. We're just going to have to see though. Um, either way, let me know your you know thoughts and opinions on the design. How do you feel about the little earth with Kith on it and a little flower growing out of it? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Would you pick it up in different colors? Because we don't know if there's other colors coming out. We only got the white tee showcase to us, but we may be getting other colors. Would you, you're just going to have to check back on when this actually releases on Monday and see if there's other colors there. So let me know all your thoughts and opinions about that in the comment section below. If you guys want me to cover more Kith releases, more Kith Monday program releases, don't forget to leave a big old like in the like section below the the like button click that like button <laughs> whatever it is whatever you want to call it just click that button and i can definitely do more kith videos for you guys but that's everything i've really got to say about the earth day monday program happy that it's releasing wouldn't mind picking it up but your boy is broke <laughs> so until the next kith video until the next streetwear video until the next sneaker video guys i'll catch you later